calibration of the instrument. When you go into the calibration menu, you have possibilities to calibrate the instrument, define parameters for the calibration task, download pre-calibration files, backing up your existing calibration library from the instrument, downloading an existing library elsewhere, showing the calibration history, or updating the library if you have just recalibrated, for example, moisture and you don't want to, to recalibrate all the other gases. Calibration task definitions are quite much like the definitions for the measurement task. In here it is ex uh, important to set parameters, excess parameters for gas exchange because during the calibration it's very important to completely flush the gas cell for a fresh sample of the calibration gas before running the calibration. You should use the same channel integration time as, as you use in, in the measurement, but if, you, if your channel integration time is different, instrument will handle it anyway. And you can select the number of measurements that will be used when calculating the statistical calibration data. Pre-calibration files are files that enhance the instrument dynamic range during the measurement. Those are factory installed and will be provided by Gasera for new gases. If you start your calibration task Instrument first shows you which gases can be calibrated, meaning which gases you have filters and you have the pre-calibration files. If you proceed, you have an option to calibrate the background or any of the other gases. And now it should be noted that you can calibrate The, the instrument one gas at a time including the background in a random order at a random time so there's no need to go through the list at once when you do the calibration the instrument guides you to connect the gas asks you for the calibration concentration of different gases and shows you the signal and the deviation of, of the signal during the calibration. So based on this information you are able to decide when the sample has been completely flushed, when your gas cell is pure enough for the calibration and when the instrument or the gas system is stable enough for the calibration. More details of the calibration and, and, and the features can be found in the user manual.